Hello, as you know, Best Growth offers rewritable or programmable knock sensors. This is the new feature that we introduced into the market last year. This is our invention. Basically, this opens possibility to access software inside knock sensor. I'm going to show you today the exact sequence, step by step, how to do that. For this, you are going to need a regular laptop with installed very simple software on it. Of course, I have already installed that software. This software is also provided by us and we also provide an instruction, detailed instruction how to install it. This is very simple. The software takes about 20 megabytes, so it's not big. So we open this software now. As you can see, we have two windows. On the left window, we will see what we have ready to be installed on the NOx sensor. But what we see on the right window is what we have at the moment inside NOx sensor. So it is time to connect all those hardwares. So this device needs to be connected with the USB connector straight straight to the to the computer. Next we need to connect this connector straight to the knock sensor. Now we have to click the connect button and now, not sooner, we plug in the power supply, 12 volts. If the knock sensor was 12, 12 volt, if it's 20, 24 volts, you have to switch the transformer to the 24 volts, of course. As you can see, the moment I connected power supply over here, we got access to the software inside knock sensor, which showed up in this right hand window. So now it's time to check what we have in our library. As we can see, this is BMW software. Here we have software for BMW and also for Mercedes Sprinter. Let's take the, the newest version of the BMW software. And if, you want, if we want to make sure that our NOx sensor has the newest update, we just click update. And now the newest update that we have in our library is being replaced with the software that is inside NOx sensor as we speak. Okay, it is done. So we can click disconnect. We can unplug the power supply and we can unplug the NOx sensor. And now this NOx sensor has already installed the newest software for the BMW. But as you know, this setup that Best Group introduced to the market allows to create entirely new model of the NOx sensor by replacing the top software. So I'm going to show you how to do that. Of course, we have to connect the main, connect, main NOx sensor connector. We need to press connect button. And now, not sooner, Plug in the power supply. So now we go to our library. We choose software for Mercedes Sprinter. So now, as we can see, on the left side, we have software for Mercedes Sprinter 9058411 ready to be installed in our NOx sensor. And here inside NOx sensor, we still have software for BMW. So we click update. And now, as we speak, as we see, we create new model of the NOx sensor. Once the update is finished, here we will see different software. 9058411 for Mercedes Sprinter. So we click disconnect. We unplug power supply, we unplug the main NOx sensor connector. 
And from now on, it is no longer BMW knock sensor. Now it is knock sensor for Mercedes Sprinter. Thank you for watching. I hope you will find this presentation useful.